many people are, are, are misled to believe that antibiotics have no effect on the body. And, um, and we'll even tell you, I took antibiotics, I had a cold, I had fever, I had, uh, you know, my body was achy, I didn't feel well, and I took antibiotics and I felt better. If antibiotics didn't work, why did that happen? Well, you have to look at what antibiotics do in the body. Uh, antibiotics suppress the immune system. Now, this right there, it has to be one of the big um, mysteries of life, that according to the germ theory, uh, uh, an infectious organism has gotten into the body, and the body can't defend itself against this organism, so it sets up a disease state or an infectious state in the body. So does it make sense, then, to take something which suppresses the immune system, which is what we normally associate with uh, us being healthy and us having the ability to eliminate infectious organisms so we don't develop colds and flus and you know, the types of diseases and conditions. It doesn't make sense at all, but yet that's what antibiotics do. They always suppress the immune system. If you look at the list of side effects for antibiotics, you'll see leukopenia, uh, neutropenia. These are, these are suppression of white blood cells, especially neutropenia is the most effective. Uh, it's like the, the heavyweight when it comes to white blood cells at getting rid of viruses and fungus, like, such as candida albicans and other infectious agents. Um, and so we're suppressing the immune system every time we take an antibiotic. And well, how does that make us feel better? Well, when we have an infection or when we have exposure to chemicals and toxins, because you also have to realize that what we may interpret as an infection or as a cold may, is most likely going to be due to all the chemicals and toxins that we're exposed to on a daily basis and less likely due to infectious agents. Um, so what we have is we have white blood cells, uh, which, produce, um, which produce substances called cytokines, proteins, and these cytokines then cause the symptoms that are fever, achiness, joint aches and pains, uh, the runny nose, uh, that overall feeling of sickness in the body. So you see that's, that's actually a healthy immune response. It's part of the, the pro-inflammatory immune response, which then sets in motion other series of events in the body which produce healing. So when we take an antibiotic and we suppress the immune system, we're also suppressing that, uh, that healing cascade or that... that um, uh, progression of healing in the body because uh, these immune cells, uh, cells and cytokine and their function play a role in this.